Hey guys, uh, welcome back to Luxa Media Online. Na ahadi ni Deni. Na dawa Deni definitely niku nikulipa. So today uh, I'm doing the video that I promised you guys uh, earlier uh, concerning how interview went and uh, yeah, chenye kiliendelea pale and uh, how I made my preparation. So it was uh, it was really simple and hard at the same time uh, because uh, after my fingerprints i had like uh, two 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 and a half weeks to prepare uh, so basically wakati unaenda fingerprints uh unapatua some of the questionnaires za ku revise nazo na iko na answers pia but then mimi si kutumia si kutumia hiyo because there are a lot of materials on youtube uh, for you to use kama yeah if you just go and uh, if you search for uh citizenship interview tutorial top a uh, hundred question top a hundred questions what i let us out both in audio yeah and in video in video form so you can always go through for me i like to listen uh doing in an audio form so when i was working i just I could just hear and answer by myself, answer by myself. Uh, but a uh, challenge na hiyo kuna vitu zingine lazima ujue kuspell ama ujue vinye zitaspelliwa like the national anthem. Hiyo ni kitu je niliona kama ilikuwa kama challenge. It looks simple but it was a challenge too. Uh, but niliweza another thing uh, kama hizi majina za president uh, kuna swali ambayo niliuliza about the who was the president during uh, first world war. Yeah during first world war that was in 1945 uh, i knew the answer lakini the first jina yake ya kwanza mimi sikwa sikwa na ijo to be honest hiyo jina ilikuwa ngumu na sikwa nimefuatilia kale kuiona on a video form isome vizuri so i knew it was wilson but i don't know the first name so i just said president wilson uh, then another thing in ilikuwa ilikuwa nilipata challenge about the name of the national anthem uh, yeah the Spingle Star Bana yeah hiyo kitu ilikuwa ni chenga I don't know why ilikuwa ni chenga so yeah so that's how I prepared then on the day of interview uh, yeah it was uh, early in the morning and I was from work so nilikuwa very eager because uh, it was something that I've been waiting for so uh, I was there it was supposed to start by 9:45 I was there at least by 9 yeah so I had at least for, 40 to 45 minutes to prepare just to make sure that I check in and everything so you have to be there on time because uh, they go yeah wana end up by time kabisa yeah america so wana waki ukichelewa kidogo you are left out until the next day because wana schedule tour to kiasi for a day uh yeah when i arrived there waliangalia kila kitu waliangalia green card aha uh -huh. wakaangalia driver license aha uh -huh. everything was good good Aha uh -huh. then I was uh, yeah lazima ku niku search pia usikuwa umekuja na weapons or whatever yeah so the search you just the normal one nikaingia okay, ndani kufika hapo hivyo uh, kufika hapo hivyo tukaingia uh, nikangojea nikaitwa then uh, the guy mwenye alikuwa na interview yeah alikuwa jamaa fulani hapo mwa America hivi mwa America hivi jamaa mpoa sana cool alikuwa anaitwa Carlos Carlos nani ni jamaa fulani ni kama Mexican American Mexican Mexican American whatever whatever you choose to say yeah ni jamaa fulani hapo hivyo yeah miki so huyu jamaa uh, alikuwa ananiambia alikuwa ananipeleka pole pole mpaka ananiambia like just slow down because tulikuwa me panic so unaona nile unarakisha so what they do they ask you the first 10 questions if you choose, uh, if you answer the first question correct the stop over there now when hiyo ni wana ku ni wana ku interview kwa political economical geographical and a general knowledge ya how much you know about us yeah wanaweza kuuliza even who is your governor or who is your senator of the state aha uh -huh. wanaweza maswali za tukienda kwa geographical which uh, which uh, ocean is on the eastern coast which ocean is on the western coast uh, which uh, which state borders mexico which state borders are uh, uh, on the other side canada what is a cool is about um, uh, which territory was acquired by us from the from the french
French uh, from uh, from France aha wanaweza kuuliza uh, kama kama hizi za war wanaweza kuuliza America ilikuwa na fight against which countries ambapo ni Japan Germany na Italy ya yeah. uh, then wanaweza kuuliza vitu kama a uh, which form of nini, eco, eco, economy America ina run unaweza inaweza kwa capitalism or market economy whichever you choose is correct uh wanaweza kuuliza about the ni uh, uh tukuja about the presidential wanaweza kuuliza about the executive or whatever yani ni maswali rais rais ni vizaje na believe kama ulikuwa um, revise to uh, nani general knowledge there's nothing new actually so it was really good Yeah. So yeah, uh we need to find the first uh, six question. Uh kama kawaida tukapita. Then from there, uh, you have to see the uh, you know the main thing but uh, from there uh wanaanza kugo sasa how you feel you feel your paperwork. Wanaanza kuuliza. Bil uh, na hiyo wakati anakuwa ameshika green card yako na amefungua list na amefungua form yako venye ulikuwa umefile. So anakuuliza eh uh, hii ni green card ulipata through ni through form gani? Kama ni through marriage or through lottery or through asylum or through work related yani kuna njia mingi or through parent i don't know I was making noise over here oh, sorry about that uh yeah so it really depends in which form uh you go the green card through so happy you america lichawaambia kitu ya kwanza honest 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 mara tatu that's the first thing wanataka kujua how honest how honest are you Yeah so you have to say uh huh like for me uh liko nimwambia i got it through my parents so wanda kujua uh -huh. uh which parents did you get uh i'm like uh, yeah, i got it through my my parents whatever uh huh uh, what about the other one who is he who is he uh do you want do you planning to bring him or her over here uh huh uh hiyo utabidi na vijao wewe mwenyewe utajua vinyo utajibu so i can't really tell you so kila mtu anajua Then from there ya yeah, wanakuuliza uh, kusaini kama uta take uh, uh, oath uh, to yeah, to be a citizen yeah and then from there uh, kuna oh uh correctly ni kwa skip after kuuliza hizo questions mtaenda kwa english uh, literature uh, kuna hiyo ni wa, kuna sentence kuna reading na kuna writing uh, watakwambia just a simple question like who is the father of the united states Aha, uh -huh. watakwambia write it on the on the iPad, uh, iPad. So you'll have to write it down who's the father of United States. Then anakusomea jibu. George Washington. So you have to write it. So utakuwa umepita both reading and writing at the same time. So it's super simple. Wanaweza kuuza tu wanaweza kuuza tu even what is the capital city of Texas. Aha, uh -huh. you have to write what is the capital city of Texas, uh, then the other Austin. Yeah, so Yeah, kuna vitu simple kama hizo. Kama ndio tingi nigauliza what the capital city of Texas. Watu wengi wanakuambia Dallas because that was we kept uh, Dallas did I did julikana sana but the recent na uh, na Austin. Yeah, na kwanga menyamaza. So vitu kama hizo. So hivyo ndio kulienda and then after ku sign hizo kila kitu, kamaliza that was given a uh, I was lucky. Yeah, because I uh, kulikuwa na walikuwa cha schedule at oath ceremony in a week's time. It was on Thursday and I was taking my oath on uh, it was, uh, the oath ceremony was taking place the, uh, the coming Thursday. So I was just niliuliza kama niko ready to take oath then I was like, "Oh yeah, I've been waiting for this." I mean, hata kama mgeniambia ni take oath today, I was just ready for this. Yeah, so uh, I was able to take oath the next Thursday. So everything was like that. Uh, mimi sina much ya kuambia. Uh, just appreciate uh, the journey how is going on so tusha mazana na mtu za citizenship mambo na nini na kuambia my story so next takuta get to the next interesting phase uh, and everything will be okay yeah on this platform we keep on sharing uh, content ambayo inatusaidia uh, ambayo inatusaidia tunachanuana sisi wenyewe sisi kwa sisi so that's it for today i see you in the next one adios